Hi, I'm Ray Smith, General Manager for Dynamics 365 Sales. I'll be talking to you today about some of the new exciting features we're developing to integrate Microsoft Teams and Dynamics 365 in a way that allows everyone across the enterprise who engages with customers, from marketeers and sellers to customer and field service professionals, be more productive, work together better, and most importantly, to build stronger customer relationships. So what does collaboration feel like in 2021? To me, creating connection with customers in 2021 feels a bit like trying to have a conversation with a friend that you just spotted across a noisy subway platform just as they're about to board their train. Getting people's attention is super difficult, and it feels like there's never enough time. The distractions, the noise, the crowd drown out what you're trying to say. Of course, many of us are fortunate to be able to work from home, so the crowds obviously aren't physical. But the digital spaces we're meeting in and collaborating in can feel every bit as crowded and noisy as a subway station at rush hour. The distractions are just as real. How can we reduce the noise and create space for empathy and connection? That's one of the core challenges we're addressing for our customers and one of the most exciting opportunities we see in bringing Dynamics 365 and Teams together. The need is greater than ever to build relationships with customers based on empathy and a genuine understanding of customer needs. I think this quote from Alyssa Merwin at LinkedIn really captures the impact that the pandemic has had on relationship sellers. Alyssa said COVID-19 highlighted the ineffectiveness of impersonal, obviously automated outreach. Empathy and relationship building came to the forefront as sales reps engage more intentionally and thoughtfully with their buyers. I think we can all relate to what Alyssa is saying, but we also know that creating connections is also harder than it's ever been. There are several reasons for this. First, the current social and business climates creates new challenges for everyone who engages with customers across sales, marketing and service. Customers are re-evaluating their business priorities and scrutinizing all their professional relationships. At the same time, sales teams are becoming more and more distributed, so sellers need to streamline the way they collaborate with their colleagues across the business to connect with customers, even outside of CRM. Lastly, both salespeople and their customers are working remotely much more than ever before. The distractions of working from home can make it even harder to stay focused on customers. All of this means more distraction both for customers and for sellers. And unfortunately, distraction is the enemy of empathy. It undercuts our ability to put ourselves in the shoes of other people, understand their needs and build that essential trust. Technology should make it easier to deliver a great customer experience. But in reality, it often gets in the way. Sellers, marketeers, and service people rely on disparate tools and disconnected data sources to collaborate and do their jobs. Switching between them creates friction that reduces it efficiency and distracts from building relationships with customers and colleagues. To address this challenge, we're building modern, personalized workspaces. We believe business tools should be as intuitive and easy to use as consumer apps. Personalized workspaces are organized around the task that you need to do for your role, bringing together the data, the components, and tools you need to deliver that amazing customer experience. We'll show you some examples of workspaces today, including one for digital selling and one for pipeline management. These workspaces, which integrate all the capabilities of Microsoft Teams and Dynamics 365, allow sellers to be more focused and productive. As we know, selling and delivering a great customer experience requires connecting with colleagues and customers across the business, even outside of CRM. Because workspaces are built both on Dynamics 365 and Microsoft Teams, distributed sales teams can work better together, collaborating with their peers across the business with the same tools that they already know and love. Lastly, we're going to show you how integration with Microsoft Teams creates compelling opportunities for building stronger customer relationships. Sellers and marketeers work with many customers on many deals that are in different stages, with information spread across different systems. Keeping track of everything related to customers is a major pain point. Dynamics 365 provides a seamlessly connected one Microsoft ecosystem that gives you all the tools and customer data you need across devices in a streamlined experience. 
I'm first going to hand over to Erez, who's going to take you through a digital selling workspace. Over to you, Erez. Hello, my name is Erez Altus, and I'm the product lead for digital selling in Dynamics 365 sales. Today, we're thrilled to present you with a new transformative way of how remote selling becomes ultimately effective, allowing sellers to focus on conducting valuable, meaningful customer conversations, which translate into revenue. Working from a prioritized work list, we will showcase how Dynamics 365 Sales and Microsoft Teams work seamlessly together to call a prospect or join a meeting. Within Regina's record, Jacob can see a complete view of the previous interactions, including transcript and highlights. Now prepared, Jacob can go ahead and conduct a call to discuss her mortgage application. Notice how Jacob can keep within the same screen context without needing to jump between applications and still be able to access business data, transcript, and take notes. Any business critical insight mentioned during the call will be highlighted so that Jacob can reach points of interest within seconds. Moreover, any follow-up or commitment made during the call is automatically captured and added to the notes on demand so that Jacob can forget about forgetting. As the call concludes, all of the notes are available for Jacob to review. Within seconds, Jacob is presented with a rich call report, summarizing the call's highlights, addressing the varying sentiment throughout the conversation, and enabling playing back the recording. Jacob can also go ahead and schedule a follow-up for the action items discovered. This call report is then saved as a part of Jacob's customer journey within Dynamics. Now on to Jacob's next task, which is a book meeting with David. With one click from within Jacob's workspace, he can join the meeting and view the Dynamics panel right inside the Teams app alongside presenting and video conferencing. Similarly to the audio call, a real-time transcription with important mentions highlighted is accompanying the conversation with the customer. And in the same manner, action items from the meetings are captured and can easily be added to the notes section. Just as before, when the meeting ends, all the notes, suggested actions, transcription, and other insights are saved back to Dynamics without any proactive action required by Jacob. In a world where time is tight, it's important to optimize customer engagements by providing insights that count. Automating the call reporting process and tying interactions with organizations' business needs ensure no action is missed and effectively allows a sales team to work together to drive customer success. Thanks for watching the demo. Thanks, Erez. Digital selling with Microsoft Teams integration is available now, and we're excited by the momentum that's building with our early customers. Next, we'll give you a demo of embedded collaboration in a pipeline management workspace. The proliferation of messages and channels and collaboration tools makes it hard to separate the signal from the noise. Personalized workspaces built on Microsoft Teams and Dynamics 365 provide a space where collaboration can be streamlined and focused on the needs of the customer. I'm going to hand you over now to Michael to take you through that. Over to you, Michael. Thanks, Ray. Sales is increasingly a team sport, requiring sellers to collaborate at various stages of the deal lifecycle across a wide spectrum of stakeholders. The speed at which they do so directly impacts their ability to close deals faster and ultimately beat their sales goals. By combining the power of Microsoft Teams and Dynamics, we have a unique ability to bring together two powerful platforms and provide context-driven collaborative experiences in both Dynamics and Teams. Now let me walk you through the experiences we're shipping in this upcoming release wave. We're going to start here in an opportunity record within Dynamics 365 sales, and I'll demonstrate how David, a new account manager at Contoso, can quickly collaborate in the context of his sales records. David opens up the Embedded Teams collaboration pane to see his conversations related to this record. These include one-on-one -on -one conversations, group chats, and even suggested contacts derived from data specific to this record. He can also expand the list to see all his recent chats and can even switch views to see his associated channels to this record. Now, because David can view these conversations organized within the context of his deals, he doesn't have to spend valuable time switching apps and digging through a long chat list to find relevant team members and conversations. David sees a group chat for a demo team that he knows recently presented to the customer. 
With one click, he opens up the chat conversation and now has a full chat experience here within Dynamics. Chat history, message actions, rich text editor, file attachments, emojis, and GIFs. David reaches out to the team saying he heard the pitch didn't go well and that he'll pull in a product specialist to help out. Now, because this is all powered by Microsoft Teams, chat participants are seeing messages come through in real time, and he sees one of the team members responding back. Now, David knows the team needs some expert help, but doesn't recall who can assist. He navigates to the connected account, and as he navigates around Dynamics, his chat window persists, but the context of the chat list changes to offer a different set of conversations associated to that record. Now, this helps him quickly locate the right people in conversations, keeping him in context and saving him valuable time. David sees someone he's added to the account in the past and opens up the chat history to quickly see Ben is capable and ready to help out with the pitch. David quickly jumps back over to the group chat thread to add Ben, share previous chat history, and give the team a heads up that he can help out. Now, this embedded Teams collaboration experience will also be released within the new Sales Pipeline Management workspace coming to preview in this upcoming release wave. This workspace will empower sellers to more efficiently cycle through their most important deals and see the key sales data and insights, including relevant chats, all within a centralized experience. And beyond experience for sellers, we're also bringing this capability to Dynamics 365 customer service and field service, empowering agents and technicians to resolve customer issues faster by collaborating with the right expert directly from their Dynamics 365 workspace. Now, we're excited about bringing Teams into Dynamics, but we also recognize sellers collaborate on sales records from within Teams. To address that need, we are introducing features that empower sellers to search for and share customer records directly within a chat or a channel. Members of that conversation will then be able to view and edit details directly within the conversation flow without even having to leave Teams. And we're taking that concept even further by enabling sellers to select a post and quickly save to Dynamics as a note or a task all in just a few clicks. This is powerful because key insights, notes, and tasks are constantly being shared within Teams, but this valuable data doesn't always flow back to CRM. And with the security you can trust from Microsoft, only individuals with the appropriate license and access rights can see and edit the data. Now, what you saw in these demonstrations was collaboration in context from within Dynamics and Teams. And we believe this experience continuum will truly empower our users to be more productive and ultimately build better customer relationships. Back to you, Ray. Thank you, Michael. Embedded collaboration is in preview, and the feedback from our early customers has been incredibly positive. Next, we'll hear from Lori Lampkin, who will talk about how Dynamics 365 and Teams integration allows for stronger connection with customers before, during, and after events. Over to you, Lori. Thanks, Ray. As we all know, virtual meetings and webinars have now become a way of life. Let's see how Microsoft Teams and Dynamics 365 Marketing can help. First, here I am in Dynamics 365 Marketing, and I'm creating an event. And as part of doing this, I ha simply have to choose that I want to stream this event online, and I can choose my streaming provider. Right there is an option for it to be Microsoft Teams. And as soon as I click on that, I can get attendee URL, and send that out to all of my attendees. And it's that simple to create a new event using Microsoft Teams with Dynamics Marketing. In addition, from Microsoft Teams, it's really easy to create webinars. Here I am in Microsoft Teams and as pull down the new meeting and click on webinar. From here, I can customize the registration form and require attendees to register. At the conclusion of the event, I get a nice list of all of the attendees and their activity. What would be really interesting is if I could follow up with those attendees and send them on a journey and continue the conversation. To do that, right from within Teams, I can click follow up with participants. It will connect Microsoft Teams to your Dynamics 365 marketing organization. And when you do that, it will export the data, uh, all of the, that customer data into Dynamics for marketing. It will create segments for those customers who's attended, who's not attended, who left, and it will create a set of starter customer journeys that allow you to uh, follow up with attendees who registered, 
follow up with attendees who attended or follow up with attendees who canceled. From here, you get the full power of Dynamics 365 Marketing, where you can customize this journey to, to do different interactions or, or delay the send or send a very customized, personalized email specific to that experience. So what you just saw is how Microsoft Teams and Dynamics 365 Marketing allow you to create awesome webinars and events and turn around and follow up with attendees in a very personalized and customized fashion. Back to you, Ray. Thanks, Laurie, and thanks everyone for joining us. We hope you've enjoyed the glimpse into the exciting new capabilities made possible by the integration of Dynamics 365 and Microsoft Teams. We're just at the beginning of this journey and looking ahead to delivering even more experiences that will allow everyone who engages with customers to be more productive, work together better, and build stronger customer relationships.